Welcome back to the Star Sports Premier Badminton League. There she is, India's star. It's PV Sindhu. Now, Tanvi Lad gets her chance this evening. She cost just one lap rupee at auction. PV Sindhu costs a little bit more than that. And she will be looking to really. On my right, Hyderabad 100, represented by PV Sindhu. On my left, Abad Warriors, represented by Tanvi Lal. You can see straight away Charmaine Reed alongside herself, Dan Strange, so Charmaine. The one, way that PV instigated that point and manoeuvred the uh, her op op opposite player there was unbelievable. Tanvi Lal just couldn't go. She destroyed. Um, Okahara in the finals, 21-7, 21-7. So she's one of the best in the world, and, and it's going to be very, very tough. Uh, Tambi gets her first point. PV Cinder just had a glance across at the... Well, PV's uh, confidence now is, is so strong. A few years ago, she, she didn't have those wins, and now she's having those wins. It makes a big difference. Her attack is so good, her reach is good, and... Uh... Not the year at the Malaysian Masters. Quarter finalist, lost to tight. To you. Excellent again, stepping in. Rapidly done by Sindhu. 4 1. And that's what PP Sindhu does so well. She comes in nice and high. Watch her reach right here. Takes one big step and puts it away. Comprehensive Play. start for the Hunters. And I think that's what we're going to see. Sindhu really takes control out here. I was talking to Tanvi Lato um, when she was 51 in the world. She went to a school over in the UK and she blew her knee out and she had to have that operation. So she was playing well back then. She just came back in April of, of last year. That's why she struck. Really, from a Jim Badminton point of view, we want Tanvi Lato as well as she can. Out it goes. 8-1 at the break. Well, it couldn't have been easier, really, for PV Sindhu. No, Bei Wen Zhang today for her to face. Tambi Lad put in instead by the Arad Warriors, and currently there's a seven-point margin at the break. Minus one, Arad Warriors losing the first trump in 13 in this year's PBL. in a row, including part of last season. Records tumbling. <laughs> out it goes again. And Sindhu starts as she means to go on out the break. Yeah, Sindhu moving around the court nice and smooth out there. No pressure on her. Trying out all of her shots and... Uh, 5'10", that's 1.79 meters high, and she uses her height very well. Excellent reach there from Sindhu, down low. just hugs and grips and flips and over the net and Sindhu gets the point. It just sat on top of the net. Couldn't decide which way it goes. Watch this, Sindhu, nice spin. Oh, perfection. Absolutely, Please. you know when you're one of the best in the world, everybody's trying to beat you, that extra pressure. You want to always play well and you want to always play up. So uh, yeah. always trying to keep your composure. Everybody's out to get you, so it's tough. Again. Two points in a row, two errors in a row. Three last points, Sindhu's errors. Ben Lane and Sean Vendy in the background, the Hyderabad Hunters. Yeah. Just too much taken off it from oh, Tambi Ladd for Sindhu. She blasts into the net, trying to lift.
A solid rally. That one goes down the line, waited for that opportunity, but uh, so Tanvi Ladd really playing her, four. getting back nice and deep, and Sindhu puts it away a little bit short on that one. 239. Very nice. Cutting smash across so court from Sindhu. Those 13 6 13, coming after her World Championship win, the rest of 2019. Slightly below par from Sindhu. What were your thoughts on that, and what do you think she needs to do? coming into Olympic year. You know what, coming into, it's a big oh. year this year, but the, the women's singles race, you have Chen Yufei and uh, Okahara as well, and uh, so it's just a big, big mix out there, but it's a confidence. I think PB Sindhu has that confidence now, and she can win anything. Yeah. It's game point, and it stays at game point, because oh. Sindhu, as you said, confident enough to go for the jugular there, and Seven, she missed 14. it. Signers, bronze in 2012. Wait. Sindhu took silver in 16. Imagine if she can take gold. Or even Signer take gold next year, this year. Into the net, under the net it goes from Tambi Ladd, and there is the game. 15-8. A comfortable win for PV Sindhu in the first. grind to the, the mat, it still gets slippery when you're when you're sweating out there. Time to be working very hard here. Yeah. One shot too many. PV right Sindhu now. very, very calm. Home crowd delighted to see their team, but also delighted to see the genuine star of Indian badminton. Again, just watch how she comes under the shuttle when she spins that one and it comes tumbling straight down. It's a hard one to return and control. Too low. Too low. And it was 8 1 at the break in the first. Oh, delightful from Sim Sindhu. She was not in the mood Three, for low. messing around there and her delivery of the shot cross court was really domineering. Last second, it's an 18 shot rally, just barely skims the tape. You know, a good game, the other team, despite the ranking mismatch, is important for her. She needs as many good hit outs in the season as she can get. The error coming there, Tambila putting the pressure on. 2 4. Exactly, you want to get a good game out there. Tambila has no pressure in this uh, game, and uh, not that PV Sindhu does have the pressure, but. Bei Wenzang, a little bit uh, of a left leg injury, but uh, I was talking to the coach and she'll be back again, but just had the day off, which could have been a little bit of a tighter match as well. Okay, so Bei Wenzang so beat PB Sindhu last year. Five, two. Sindhu went two losses in a row in the PBL four. And speaking of Carolina Mar Marin, back in 2011 in Maldives, it was both Sindhu and uh, Carolina Marin. I was watching them and they're both young players. I thought both of them are going to shine the pv sindhu went win, won that uh, tournament so even back in 2011 i thought you know what she could be one of the best in the world Three, and, and here she is now in one the pbl pbl three. it's, in. it's being given in tambi lad looks amused and she challenges she gave the referee a bit of an eye roll there was uh, she didn't delay that much? No, not not much of a delay on that, I have to say. <laughs> Too good from Sindhu, and now the gap opens up once Seven more. Four. Seven for the score. Well, it may have saved Tambi. 
Not throwing any way a challenge anyway. Lad trying to pick up on the backhand there. Now the Hyderabad bench are delighted, and that takes us to the break at 8 4. 327 kilometers an hour. Well, Vladimir earlier, 392. TV Sindhu at the moment. Not as easy as in the first, but she's 8 4 up in the second and 1 nothing in the game. She's not having it all her own way, but it's easy enough. Yes, PV Sindhu is so strong out there, and Hamby uh, Ladd, she's trying to she's trying to do cross court at, at the net as well, and she's really trying to fight her way into it. But uh, PV Sindhu, look at that smash, incredible, and that's what she does so well. Nine four. Nine four. If PV Sindhu comes alive here, she really could finish this off in a matter of moments. 317 kilometers an hour. And the angles, the reach that she has, and that power, she, she, she's so dangerous on attack. Oh, barely gets that one back. Excellent shot from Tammy Ladd. And the world champion scrambling. The, the coaching team find it quite funny. Yeah, just barely gets her racket on this. Watch, all stretched straight out. Goes cross. Makes PV Sindhu change direction on that one. They've been Jow around Robbie. Lost to Chen Yu Bei. Akani Yamaguchi in three games. Were you, were you surprised by that, Charmaine? Were you surprised she didn't make it through? Round Robin at the World Tour Finals. You know what? Like I said, the women's singles, it's so entertaining right now because anybody can win. Before, China used to dominate the women's singles, but now it's all up for grabs. Carolina Marin coming back from her knee injury last year, playing phenomenal, yeah! looking towards that Olympics. You have PV Sindhu, Tai Su Ying, Chen Yu Fei, uh, a whole bunch of Japanese players that can win. So it, it's a very Olympic exciting time ten. in women's singles uh, around the world. And this girl right here, has a great shot at the gold in Tokyo. 0.31 seconds for Tambilad to respond. And she did. And she does so again. And she's dropped it in again. 7 10. Tambilad is not Seven, giving PV Sindhu this all her own way. 0.3 that time. Now they're getting their money's worth. Net though. That time was stopping the run. Seven, seven. Suddenly, Sindhu looks focused. She plays down in Bangalore and she wants to do well, so she wants to move her ranking up. <laughs> the net steps in, 12, seven. stops the rally. And it only cost one lakh rupees. All the Awad Warriors. And up is her coach down in Bangalore as well, who's coaching the team. And she said that she wanted to have won more Super Series last year. Bar that, everything went to plan. Enjoying the badminton at the moment. Looks relaxed around the place as well. Another unforced error. Statistic, but forehand on forced errors flashed up. Match point. And it's match point. PB Sindhu takes that angle cross court. Match point. Oh, it lands kindly. Now PB is going to go upstairs here and ask for the review. She's walking Sindhu. off. Let's have a look. This is match point. Stays at match points as well, it was in. Challenge unsuccessful, one challenge remaining. So one challenge remaining, but also this two. But Hyderabad, three minus one to the good. Yeah. There it is, done and dusted, finished relatively quickly. Although Tambi Lad fought hard and 
did well picking up 16 points overall. The Hunters, though, at the moment, going in for the kilt. They're doing very, very well in this tight. Three minus one.